Hello. Uh, hello, everyone. This is Steve, uh, founder of Fred, uh, Data Finance. It's a pleasure to introduce Fred here, an amazing DeFi product on FICON. Uh, I know you guys have field token, right? And uh, your token may be in an exchange account or wallet. And uh, you know, we are in a bear market, right? You don't want to sell your field token at the current price. It's very, very low. And, uh, but uh, the field token you exchange account or wallet doesn't generate any, any income for you. Uh, so Flit is a staking service. You can stake your field token in the smart contract and earn a stable, reliable income. And it's permissionless and it's decentralized. <coughs> so Flit is a decentralized staking service enabled by a protocol that can tokenize the storage power. It's not a landing pro, uh, platform. You land the fuel to a platform. No, it's a staking. So staking versus landing, they are different. Uh, landing platform, you pass the ownership to the token to the platform. Staking, you basically still have the control to your token. You can withdraw your asset anytime you want. <coughs> but let me introduce how Flit works. Uh, users, I mean the fuel token holders, stake fuel token into a smart contract. And the smart contract will select a storage provider and pledge the field token. Uh, and the storage provider will use the token to seal the data. You know, in FICOM, you need a field token to seal data. <coughs> and uh, the, the node receives the, the field token, seal data, and they will receive broker reward and other income like uh, retrieval fees. And those fees and the broker rewards, 50% uh, of that will become the income and uh, send it back to the affiliate smart contract. Then users can claim the income from the smart contract. So that's how Fred works. Fred is the number one staking service on FICON today. Uh, today we have 120,000 field tokens already staked in the platform. And uh, until today, till today, it already distributed 20,000 field tokens as income to the stakeholders. Uh, with the annual APY average 33%, it's a very high APY. <coughs> uh, so don't let your FI token, field token stay on you exchange account or wallet, you should stick in the thread. I will give you four compare reasons why you should do that. <coughs> so thread offers 30% uh, APY. Uh, you may ask why the APY is quite high as a DeFi product. Yeah. So basically it's imparted by the most efficient and the reliable storage providers <coughs> in the industry. Uh, and the team behind the fleet, they have optimized the FICOM mining software. It's basically a different version than the official software. And they also build a very low cost and high efficient mining machines. Uh, have a very special customized motherboard and uh, hardware, I mean special hardware component. Uh, and all the storage miners, they operate in North America. And uh, you know, you know, North American has the best, uh, best, uh, best internet, and the highest chance to get a storage deal. That's all contribute the efficiency, mm. then uh, provide the high APY. <coughs> so there's some reason for high APY. It's more because of the technology behind that. <coughs> so, as a DeFi product, user really concern about the security of the asset. Right? You stake the asset into a platform. You need to know, is my asset still secure? Can I get back my asset anytime I want? Mm. So FED is a smart contract. So the asset you stake is protected by a smart contract, not a human, not by organization. It's decentralized. Uh, 
So you can trust the smart contract. And the smart contract is audited by 30K, a famous security company in crypto industry. And all the storage miners operate in North America. Uh, you know, in North America, you know, there's no censorship and no regulation risk. Unlike like other countries, like in Asia, maybe someday government shut down your node, <laughs> then you lost your all the asset on the node. <coughs> And transparency is very critical to a DeFi product. <clears throat> you need to know where is your asset, and you need to know how the income is generated. <clears throat> uh, you need to know how it works. Uh, so the fairly smart contract, the source code is already open sourced on GitHub. You can read the source code and understand how it works. <clears throat> and uh, the staking asset and the income data can view on the blockchain with a browser, so it's always open there. And the mining, uh, the storage provider connect to the fleet platform is also open and public. The data center in Silicon Valley, you can visit the data center, you can, you can see them. Uh, <coughs> so fleet is deployed on multiple blockchain Currently, it's supported the Binance Smart Chain. It's supported the Huobi Heiko Chain. And the native field token is partially supported. I mean, partially. Uh, with the upcoming FVM, native field will be fully supported. Uh, so right now, if you need to stake a native field, you will need to uh, download a, a special wallet app from us and uh, use that wallet app to stake in your field token. So the mission of Flat is to connect the field token holders with the storage provider. You know, one of the biggest headaches of storage provider, they need a huge amount of field tokens to seal storage power. Uh, today, basically, one T power, you need about like 5.5 field token. That's a lot. Yeah, think about that. A storage provider basically need a 10P to get a smooth block reward. If we have very small uh, storage power, let's say 1P, maybe today you get one block reward, next 10 days you, get, you don't get any block reward. <coughs> so think about it, if you need to see your 10P data, you need 55,000 field tokens. <coughs> so that's a huge barrier. Uh, and with affiliate, because the users stake into the platform, the platform can pledge the field tokens to the storage provider. So that will remove the huge barrier. Mm. So we will open the fleet service to third party storage provider very soon. So we will welcome any storage provider to talk to us. Uh, uh, with the fleet, you no longer need to worry about uh, the field tokens. We already built a very strong partnership with the big players in the industry, like uh, exchanges, wallet, and uh, big storage providers. <coughs> you know, in this industry, the crypto industry, code is low, right? But uh, in the end, uh, the team makes the code. Uh, so ultimately, the team decides the security of the product. <coughs> And uh, our team is based on Silicon Valley. Uh, I personally live in Silicon Valley for over 22 years. And uh, I was the first employee of WebEx, the web conference king before Zoom. Uh, uh, the Zoom boss, Eric, he reported to me 20 years ago. <laughs> we worked in WebEx there. Uh, later, I founded Top Network, which is a public blockchain, very high speed blockchain platform. It can process. 2,000 transactions per second. It's like a Solana Neo protocol. Uh, so it's the very same team develop a top network, develop the Fillet technology stack. So that's the reason why Fillet has such a secure and high efficient technology and provide a high return. And we operate about 300p data in Silicon Valley, in three data centers uh, with 200 racks. Uh, it, it's in Silicon Valley, you guys can visit that. So it's a very large scale. We are probably the biggest uh, 
storage provider in North America. <coughs> uh, so that's behind the Fleet. Uh, that's uh, why Fleet can offer stable, reliable, high return. <coughs> uh, thank you. If you have few tokens, stick into it. <laughs>